Okay, I'm going to do the uh, veins of the lower abdomen. And again, uh, please remember that the blood supply uh, travels from the feet up to the inferior vena cava. Uh, but I'm going downwards uh, for just for teaching purposes. But remember, the blood flow is taking the blood back to the heart by, via the inferior vena cava. Okay, uh, so I will start right here, the first one. Uh, that will be the large branch which goes into the kidney, which is over here. This is the left kidney. And uh, that will be the left renal vein, which is right here. Sometimes the renal veins have uh, multiple branches going into the into that organ. Here's one, here's another one. And above it is uh, the adrenal uh, lumbar vein, which is here. Okay, as we go downwards, uh, you will see the branches and it, go, it goes underneath the artery, but uh, I used this cat to explain the arteries as well, so I didn't cut away the artery. So the uh, abdominal vein continues downward, and again it forks, and what branches do you see? Here in this cat, there is the right iliolumbar over here and let's see if I can find the right iliolumbar yep here's the right iliolumbar back here the blue that you see back there and again that's not symmetrical too sometimes they're uh, anatomical variations sometimes they're very far apart so be aware of that okay and then it will fork into the left and right common iliac which is here so this is the left common iliac and the right common iliac is back there I'm going to slide the cat up a little bit so you can see the leg and uh, the reason they call it common iliac is because you have blood flowing from the foot to the to the inferior vena cava uh, by two main branches, and the two main branches is the uh, external iliac, which is here, and the internal iliac, which is down here. So uh, this will help you with the name. External iliac, internal iliac, turns into common iliac. Again, uh, if you're thinking about the blood flow, the, the names should make sense. Now the veins uh, are named similar to the arteries. And uh, let's see what I can find here. Uh, on this cat, it, the superior articular vein uh, was uh, broken. There's only a little piece of it left, so which is what I have it here in the forceps. But uh, right uh, inferior to it, you can see the popliteal, which goes behind the knee. So superior articular, popliteal, and saphenous. And uh, that uh, should be the end of the veins.